check out this 76,000 original mile 1967 Lincoln Continental convertible. The paint needs to be redone on this car in the worst way, but it's a very nice, solid, original car. Front bumper is in excellent original condition. It's got a really nice chrome finish to it still. The grill, headlight area, all that's in great shape as well. The paint has tons of checking. It's original paint. It's just got tons of checks on it. Um, so some of this paint would need to be stripped. As far as the engine goes, we didn't have to do a tune-up or nothing to it. It runs absolutely excellent. It's got the 462 four barrel. Under the hood, all looks nice and clean. A little bit of surface rust tint up here, but all in all, just very solid. It does have air conditioning. Um, the belt's off the compressor, so it probably needs a little work on the air conditioning. It's got power steering, it's got power brakes. A very nice, quiet engine. As far as our hood goes, it shuts nicely. The gaps are in excellent shape on the driver's side and across the front. Passenger side is nice, front to back. There's about three or four panels on this car that have already been painted and look great. Um, the uh, passenger side front fender is one of them. It's been repainted. The rest of the cars, the body works all been sanded and stuff, but it needs to be repainted yet. Bottom of the front fender, passenger side, rocker panel, um, and the doors are all in excellent shape. No blisters. It's got a couple blisters right here in the dog leg, right in front of the rear wheel. Other than that, just a lot of cracked painting, cracked paint. I don't know if you can see it here in the video all the way through. Um, needs to be stripped, but the body is laser straight. Very nice original car. Uh, door handles and stuff have just a little bit of pitting, but all in all are really clean. Side trim all looks real good. All four corners of the doors are all solid. This is not a rusty car. Very, very solid car. Another thing about it is all the uh, the dome lights work on all the doors. Door panels are all original and they're in excellent shape for original in my opinion. All the power windows work except for this one here in the back passenger side. I've got to get a new motor for it. I've got one coming. As far as uh, all of them have the ashtrays, grab handles door jam area is very solid pillar now these are unibody cars and this car has a really solid original uh, frame floors everything solid on it back seats got some seam splits at the very top of the seat it's original leather interior carpet is original still looks really good um, seats like I said has stress cracks um, will need to be recovered but for what I would do with the car right now is drive it, repaint it, and enjoy it. It does have a crack up here and by the speaker cover. Other than that, the dash is in excellent shape. Original AM radio works. Carpet, like I said, is in excellent shape. It does not need to be replaced. Listen to all the doors shut. Line up and latch real nice. The gap's great on them. The car's not sagging at all. Um, convertible tops, power, it's a retractable, everything works as it should. Back windows, it's got some glass. Again, we look up and down the sides. You know the body needs to be stripped. It's awesome, the car very straight. Here's a good picture of her under here. dual exhaust. The exhaust sounds good. That does not need to be replaced. Back bumper is original as well as far as I can see and the chrome is excellent on it. It's got a couple little little scuff right there in the corner but other than that the chrome looks beautiful. Uh, driver's side, look up and down the side. The bottoms are very straight, very nice. Um, rear quarter on the driver's side all been repainted. The paint on that's very nice and shiny. Like I said, I think they just picked two or three panels out on this car and did that and just didn't finish the whole thing. They were just doing it in pieces. Never got around to finishing the paint on the car. But if you look up and down the side, there might be one or two little tiny door dings. Other than that, that's the only bodywork needed on this car. 
It's got its original uh, hubcaps. Rear quarter is excellent. No rust, no blisters on the rocker panel or the lower fender. It's all nice and clean. As far as the top rubbers go, they're all original. They've got a little dry rot to them. They should probably be replaced. Here again, all the sill plates are super clean on it. Power seat, power seat works up and back. Power seat goes up and down. It's got all the factory seat belts and the back seat and stuff all looks really good except for at the top. We talked about <coughs> um, how good of uh, the pressure it is. Uh, the power seat the works. Pressure. All the uh, dome yeah, lights work. No Original I radio works. Time. Power antenna works as well. Go ahead and put that down. Horn works. It's got 78,000. I think I might have said 76 in the video. It's got 78,953 uh, miles, and by the condition of the car and everything, I'm sure it's original. Heater fan works good. Shut that off. Wipers work. This car, everything works on this car except for the air conditioning. Um, power power locks aren't working either. It's got power wing windows. Gas gauge works on it. Windshield's crystal clear, just like it should be. I mean, there's no doubt in my mind that this is a 78,000 original mile car. Power steering sounds good, works good. Speedometer works. It's got that kind of ribbon speedometer that goes all the way across. That's working well. Transmission shifted good. Shocks felt good right there. Horn works as well. As far as our brakes go, there's no pull left or right. Hands are off the wheel. Stop straight. Steering feels great, brakes are nice, runs good, doesn't spit and sputter. The power top all works off its uh, factory switches as well. Really takes off nice. I do have my window down. As far as running down the road, 55, 60 mile an hour. Shifts into third gear at 58 mile an hour. It's a great running driving car. Handles the road excellent. Punch it down, transmission kicks down. Really nice Lincoln. Put a nice paint job to reupholster the seat so you got yourself a really nice car.